Well, the holidays are pretty much here. A week from Thursday is Thanksgiving. Let that sink in, huh? So there might be, you know, maybe you're hosting, but at the holidays, it's a good idea to give a little tune-up to the old plumbing system. All really easy things to do and things that you, because you're in your kitchen and your home all the time, maybe you don't even notice the stink. So there's some things you can do just to keep your drains healthy. First of all, if you have a clog, if a drain opener comes in a plastic bag, you shouldn't be using it. It's really caustic, it's acid, it's kind of the old school, and we don't, that's something that we don't really use anymore. But a product that I really like is called uh, Drain, uh, what do they call it? Drain Defense. They keep changing the name of this stuff. So the way it works, it goes in and it really just eats the organic matter uh, of the, uh, what builds up, especially around disposals and different things. So a couple scoops. I know it's disappointing because it used to be blue, now it's brown. So, but you would do this, you know, once a month is what you want to get to. But if you have a problem where there's a lot of smells and stuff, I would be using this uh, maybe uh, once, a, once a week for a month and then start doing it maybe twice a month until you get to, and then you just let it sit. So you do it before you go to bed. Uh, if you don't want the, the powder is more economical, but they also make it in a liquid too. So that'll work. So that will actually help with the disposal as well as the drain smells, but you can also get regular disposal products that are that are similar. Uh, there's a uh, one that has bars where you run it, gets into the food chamber. So those are some of the things that you really, to take care of the smells and then keep the drains running. Now, let's head to the bathrooms for a, for, uh, a few more things. Okay, so probably a lot more things to do in the, in the bathrooms because there's just a lot more to go wrong. So mainly in the kitchens, it can be clogs and smells. But in the bathrooms, it's a little bit of everything. So here is something that everyone should have. This is like the simplest thing, but it will blow the clogs. Generally on a, on a laboratory sink, it's a hairball, right? So this goes down and hooks it and pulls it back up. No, I'm not gonna show you that on TV. But what people tend to do, they come to the store and think, oh yeah, I need a drain cable. Well, a drain cable you cannot get down because there's a trap down there and you just can't get it up and around. And generally, like I say, this will take care of it. I mean, they're like two or three bucks. They're really, everyone should, this makes a great stocking stuffer. So I would definitely look into that. And same thing on the toilet, you can't take, it's really hard to take a, because the, the trap of a toilet goes down, up, and over. So that's why having a drain tool, a toilet cleaner like that is important, especially if you have guests in and you want to have those tools on hand. Again, not a lot of money, but certainly having a plunger, you don't want to make your guest have to ask for the plunger. It's like, hey, you know, I, I, I need a plunger. You know, having one uh, discreetly in the bathroom, but I would get one with a fold out, this one, a designer plunger, but isn't very good because it, it, it doesn't have great suction. It doesn't have the fold out on it. So I would get a, 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 you know, a plunger that has a little fold out, probably available in colors if you look around. On a side note, if you have uh, roots in an older home that you have fought using copper sulfate, this really has nothing to do with the holidays, but if you take a, a teaspoon of this once a day, just pop it in there, flush it, that will that'll stop that those hair growths of the roots to, that start in your uh, in your sewer line. So that's another great maintenance product. The holidays are here. Fix the plumbing.